In the upper Midwest, the waters are rising. The Mouse River in Minot, North Dakota, surged today to a level that broke a record set in 1881. The river is nine feet over flood stage and rising. Jamie Ukas of our Minneapolis station, WCCO, is in Minot. Jamie? Scott, Minot's mayor says more than 2,000 homes are underwater right now, and that number is expected to double throughout the weekend. Now residents like Amy Broughton can only watch the waters rise. I worked every day, raised two kids by myself in that house. <laughs> you won't be our house to go back to anymore. So we'll start over somewhere. <laughs> Amy Broughton's one of 12,000 evacuees, about a quarter of the city's population who have been forced to abandon their homes, many of which are only rooftops from above. Oh, a whole lot of water. Amy gathers what she can, even as her basement fills with water. I never envisioned it coming up the walls and being this deep already. She's when expecting a baby in four months, but could be homeless in hours. She gets strength from this message on her wall. Tell me about this. Why'd you put it on the wall? So I've always said, you know, it doesn't matter what you have. You know, I don't need a great big fancy home. You spend your life making a home with your kids and it becomes very important to you. And I've always said it, you know, it's just stuff. It's easy to say, but hard to live by, I think. Now, 90% of people in the flood zone are like Amy. They don't have any flood insurance. And the waters here are expected to rise another five feet throughout this weekend and stay that way, Scott, for several days. Jamie, thanks.